cheated, lied to, or tricked, she's tackling every opportunity to make something that went wrong right. Better Call Bacon is on your side. A Spring Hill woman just wants to pay her taxes. But the IRS won't process her returns, saying that according to their records, she's dead. When she couldn't convince them otherwise, she knew she'd better call Bacon. This is the third tax year that the IRS mistakenly thought Carol Jean Murphy was deceased. And this year, she asked for my help to prove she's definitely alive. That's why there's got to be a glitch someplace. There's Carol Jean Murphy there. opened the mailbox last week to find disturbing news. The IRS thinks she's dead and won't process the tax return she filed in February. So why does the IRS think that you're dead? Because Social Security told them so. This is the third tax year Carol says this has happened. The instructions on the IRS letter direct her to the Social Security Administration oh, yeah. to get documentation proving she's not actually dead. I just don't know where the problem lies because when I get to Social Security, they said, no, I'm fine. Each year after sitting in a long line at the Social Security Administration and jumping through a lot of hoops, the problem is fixed, only to pop up again. So Carol knew she'd better call Bankin, and I knew I needed to help out the IRS with a little investigating. So I want to let you guys know that I'm standing here with her now, and she's alive and well, and she wants this fixed. I was promised this will be looked into. Carol is hopeful this is the last time she has to correct this mistake. The IRS. I reached out to the Social Security Administration and a spokeswoman took Carol's information and said she will have someone call her to investigate and make sure that their database is correct from now on. Well, they just she just needs to send them a video of herself saying, <laughs> look right here, she still breathing. Video. <laughs> How often does it happen? Jen said it happened to someone in her family. Yes, and we've done stories in the past. It does happen from time to time. I have to say, though, this is the first time that I've done a story on someone that it's happened to three times in a row. Mistakes happen, but this just needs to be corrected. All right. Well, thank you, Shannon. If you have a problem that needs solving, you better call Benkin. The information you need to know is right there on your screen, one 855 or WFLA Shannon.